Yes, may I help you? <laughs> <laughs> Are you going to open a shop? <laughs> Go away. <laughs> hey, I did buy them on sale and uh, I used my points. <laughs> okay, I feel better now. <laughs> <laughs> but don't I look good though? Oh, yes, absolutely. You always look good. Oh, stop. <laughs> You're beautiful. Stop. Maybe not go. I got a video to do. <laughs> okay, where was I? Hi everyone, I'm Heva and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got a haul video for you guys and yes, it's another haul video, but it's not all drugstore. My last haul video was a drugstore, but this one has some Sephora and some Nordstrom in here. And you know, I use my points. I used uh, the triple points for Nordstrom and I use my points for Ulta and so I got some gifts with purchase too so I think I scored all right well let's get to it let me show you the first thing that I'm really excited about is by Sol de Janeiro and this is the Brazilian Bod Buff and oops and oops <laughs> and I got their hand cream all right calm down all right Yes, when I saw on Instagram that they were coming out with the body scrub, I was there on Sephora app, boom, I went and got it. And the hand cream too. But this one here, it's a mask and a body scrub. So you can use it as a mask, put it on dry skin, which I haven't done um, yet, but you put it on dry skin on your body, not the face. And it's supposed to have like a Brazilian quartz in there to exfoliate. And it has that wonderful scent that is associated with their Boom Boom Cream. It does come out like a mustard color. <laughs> That's how I describe it. And believe me, a little goes a long way if you want to use it as a mask because I did try it to see, you know, for the camera to see how it would work on the hand and I think I put a little too much on my hand. So yes, a little does go a long way. And it has that wonderful smell that that is, oh, that just smells so good. And I also got the hand cream. And the hand cream, it's like a yellow color. And the hand cream is $15 and the body scrub is $25. But here's the hand cream right here. Oh, it has that wonderful smell. I use the body scrub in the shower. So after I, you know, wash myself with the loofah with the Boom Boom shower gel, and then I'll use the body scrub to exfoliate. And it just feels so good. I'm so glad they made a body scrub. So yeah, I was really excited to get that. I was really excited. CVS had Milani products, buy one, get one half off. So what did I do? I bought some eyeshadow palettes and I bought some blushes and also I bought a couple of lip, lip glosses. But let me go ahead and show you the eyeshadow palettes. I love these eyeshadow palettes. There's gonna be a couple that's gonna be in my favorites for the month of March, but I wanted to pick up a couple more, okay, maybe a few more palettes. But the ones that I did get is Bare Necessities, Natural, and Plum Basics, which has a bit more of a purpley tone, which is really nice. I love purple. So yeah, buy one, get one half off. So you're getting two eyeshadow palettes for the price was it like the 16 17 dollars for two of these and these palettes these eyeshadows they are very pigmented i'm going to try these but i know the two that i bought last month they blend out very well the color payoff is very well and the shimmers in those the palette that i have boom i mean they are boom right there <laughs> so here are the blushes that i bought i bought three of them and I believe these are new to the Milani line. And this one here is called Berry Rays. Now this one, this one's very light on my skin, but I do like it because some days you don't want a pow of a blush on your face. So this one will give me that. The other two I haven't tried yet, which are Coral Beams and Bronze Burst. And these are $10.99. So buy one, get one half off. So I kind of think I'm saving money that way, maybe. Okay, and then the two lip glosses I bought, this one's Luscious Peach and Iridescent Blue. Let me swatch these for you. So here it is right here, Luscious Peach and Iridescent Blue. I'm afraid that the Iridescent Blue will make me look like I need oxygen, 
<laughs> so we'll see how this works. Okay, another place that had, I think it was Ulta. Buy one and get one half off. I bought four more, yes, of the Healthy Lip by Physician's Formula. Yes, I know. But these, I think, retail for six or seven dollars. So you're getting two for ten, eleven, I believe. Yes, no. <laughs> So you're about ten, eleven dollars, depending, without tax, of course. And actually, I'm wearing one right now, and this one is Vitamin Beat, and I really like this one. This one looks really nice. I love the formula with these lip, with these liquid lipsticks. They're not very drying at all, and I really like this. So I got Vitamin Beat, Raisin Immunity, Coral Minerals, and Nutritious. And I'm gonna swatch these for you on my hand. Okay, here they are right here. Here you have vitamin beets, what I have on my lip right now. Raisin immunity, coral minerals, and nutritious. I love this formula. I really do love this formula. Okay, I bought also two other lip glosses and this was in my uh, Get Ready With Me. And if you saw that video, I have to be very careful with how I say this. This is by Soap and & Glory and this is the Sexy Mother Pucker. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a different name, you know, but I kind of like it. And it does have uh, the plumping. It does plump your lips. And the two colors that I got was Super Peach and Nude Star. And the one I tried in the video was Nude Star. Okay, I don't know if you can see that, but this is Super Peach and Nude Star. But yeah, I think I got it more for the name. Sexy Mother Pucker. You know, just be careful how you say it. Don't let it uh, slip. <laughs> now let me tell you these eyebrow pencils. I was watching Bonnie Lynn, her channel, and I'll link her channel down below. And the name of her channel is Bonnie Lynn. And she was talking about these e.l.f. eyebrow pencils. These are only $2 each. And granted, they only have three shades, but let me tell you, they are really nice. It's what I'm wearing right now. I'm wearing the shade Neutral Brown. And for $2, I think you're getting more than what you're paying for in this one. It does come with a really nice spoolie on one end. There's the spoolie right there. And here is the pencil itself. It is a little bit thicker than what you would get like from the Anastasia Beverly Hills or the Benefit Precisely My Brow. It's a little bit more of a thin tip, but this works out really well. I really like this. And yes, it only comes in three colors. And I did pick up the two, the medium brown. I think this one's called Neutral, neutral Brown and Deep Brown. So thank you, Bonnie Lynn, for showing this to us. I will link Bonnie Lynn's channel down below. She is, she is a really great YouTuber. She does a lot of reviews and a lot of uh, tutorials, so please check her out. And I'll, again, I'll link her channel down below. And another YouTuber that made me buy some stuff. <laughs> yes, you do get a lot of useful information from these channels. I mean, I'm glad I'm finding it. And this channel is Breakups to Makeup. Demetra from Breakups to Makeup. And I'll link her channel down below. She is also another wonderful YouTuber. I mean, she's got a great sense of humor. She, she cracks me up every time I watch her. And she does excellent reviews, dupes, videos, and tutorials. And she found this dupe of the Tom Ford, the eyeliner pen, which I love. This one's from J Cat Beauty, and I bought two of them. And these eye pencils are called Rock and Glitz Liquid Eyeliner. And these are $6.99 each. And the two shades that I got are Tuxedo Mask and Sable Black Shimmer. Actually, I'll link that video down below so you can see how she how she does it side by side with the Tom Ford. But this one here, I mean, it's it's a really nice dark black, and you know I love my my black eyeliner. Woohoo! This one here is a Tuxedo Mask, and then this one here is the Black Sable Shimmer. So this one's got a little bit of a shimmer to it. There it is right here, and there's Tuxedo Mask. And actually what I have on now is Tuxedo Mask on the top of my um, lash line right here. I love my black eyeliner pencil. I do, I do. And another thing that Demetra from Breakups to Makeup made me buy 
<laughs> but it's 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 all good. It's all good. I bought the Creator Palette by Pure, and this is the first time. I'm sorry, it got dark here. And this is the first time I've ever bought anything from Pure. And when I saw this palette on her channel, it looked gorgeous. And I, again, I'll link that video down below so you can see that. But it comes with a mirror, and in the mirror it says, don't just dream it, create it. Because this is the Creator palette. And here are the colors right here. I mean, aren't they just beautiful? And another thing I like about this is that you can take off this felt border, I guess you could say, and these are magnetized. So you can take these out and put it in a smaller palette for travel, a, a smaller Z palette to travel with. You can add more shadows to this. You can, you know, take away and put some different shadows in here, which is a really neat idea. And the colors. Let me let me swatch this pink one here and then this blue one. I mean, just gorgeous. And let me swatch this gold one here too. Those are just three beautiful shimmer shadows. It comes with 12 shadows and a highlighter and a contour. Now this contour may be a little light for me, but I could probably use this as a transition shade. So thank you, Demetra, for bringing this again to my attention. I really do like the formula with this, uh, with this brand. I liked it so much that I went ahead and bought two more palettes. Oh yeah, and this one retails for $42. So let me show you the other two palettes I bought, and I bought these palettes using my points from Ulta. And I kind of like their reward system better than uh, Sephora because you can use those points to actually buy full-size products. So the palettes that I did buy is, by, is also by Pure. And this is the Visionary palette. This is an eyeshadow palette and the blush palette. The blush book, the 4-in-1 blush book. Let me show you the palette first, the Visionary palette. Again, when you open it up, it comes with a mirror and it says, Visionaries create with others only dream. That's what it says on the mirror here. And here are the shadows, a little bit more of a purpley pink tone. But I haven't used this palette yet because I just got it, uh, I believe, last week. So I haven't had time to use this palette. If it's anything, let me swatch some. If it's anything like the, the Creator palette, oh, they are really creamy though. Let me try this purple one here. Let me go one more. Let me go pink. And here are the shades right there. I mean, you can great, make a great look with that. But yes, yeah, so I use my points from Ulta with this one. This one retails for $32. And then the blush palette. Or the, the blush book, I should say. This one here, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. This one does not have a mirror when you open it up. But it does say, every day is the perfect day to blush. So that's what it says up here. And look at these colors. Look at these blushes. This one here is what drawn to me, the orange. And again, with also the Visionary palette, you could also take the shadows out of this one and put it in a, another Z palette, you know, you, so you can create your, create your own look. And you could also take the blushes out of here also. I think I said also many times. Hmm. But the blush that I'm wearing right now is this one right here, and this one's called Honest, right here. So as you can see, that's the blush I'm wearing right now. I know you can hear the birds outside. It's a beautiful day outside. And the orange. I've worn this one, and I love this orange one here. And let me tell you, a little goes a long way. I think I put this one on, I put it on my brush, and I put it on my cheek, and it was like, wow. It looked like a clown, like a round circle of pink right here. <laughs> and as you can see, it comes with three colors, so it's kind of like an ombre effect. And I'm going to swatch each one, each you know, stripe, and then I'll swirl my finger around and swatch all three together on my arm for you guys. So you have honest, passionate, determined, and loyal. And this one costs $36. And again, I use my points and the formula here, I'm I am now a lover of the Pure Cosmetics. So thanks, Demetra, for bringing the Creator Palette to my attention. Again, I'll link her video of the Creator Palette and the J-Cat Beauty down below, and the Bonnie Lens of the Eyebrow Pencil, the $2 Eyebrow Pencil. I think I went a little palette heavy, eyeshadow palette heavy this time. 
but they were so pretty. Of course, everyone's seen the Anastasia Beverly Hills, the Soft Glam palette. You know, I won't do swatches of, the, of these because, you know, it's everywhere all over YouTube, but here are the colors right here. I really like the, it's, it's a really neutral palette, but I really do like these, these three shades right here. I think these three shades right here are what I'm drawn to and everything else. So yeah, I did get that. And I also got the Natasha Denona, the mini sunset palette. I have her big sunset palette that I absolutely love. And I'm hoping these are the, like her, the same kind of formula. So I went ahead and bought the mini, the mini sunset palette. And this is $25. And again, you've seen this all over YouTube. And if you wanted to try her, her shadows, but didn't want to spend $129 for her palettes, this will be a nice, you know, entryway into that, into that world. Okay, and the last palettes that I bought are from Dose of Colors. These, these eyeshadow palettes right here. I bought Baked Browns, Sassy Sienna, and Marvelous Mauves. And actually, Ulta is having their 21 Days of Beauty, and on Sunday, they will have this one for half off for $16. So again, if you want to try some of the shadows from Dose of Colors and just didn't want to leap in yet, this will be a great palette to start. And actually, it's what I'm wearing right now on my eyes. So here's the Marvelous Mauves, and it's what I'm wearing. I use this one to set the primer. Then I put this one on the crease for my transition. Then I put this one underneath the transition, this one on my lid, and this one on my outer V. So I'm going for an all matte look which is, you know, I do like my shimmer, but these being all matte, they are creamy, they are blendable. I am in love with these shadows. And look at this one right here, the Sassy Sienna is right here. Now the only bad thing about the Sassy Sienna is there's no light color you can set your primer with, but I can pull in another palette from that. These colors are beautiful, look at that. And with that orange blush from Pure, you got a look going. And here's the baked browns. And I'll put a picture of all three of these palettes together so you can kind of see how, you know, different they look. They do have a lot of kick up to them, so you need to make sure you blow your brush or tap your brush before you put it on your lid. And there's hardly any fallout on your cheeks. None whatsoever that I've encountered with. And you know, I kind of like the brush that it comes with. This is a great brush, you know, to use underneath your lash line. To use it right here, it's a really nice blush, uh, brush. So yes, I know I did go a little eyeshadow palette heavy, but it's good. It's all good. Okay, the next thing that I bought, also from Milani, it is the Conceal and Perfect Foundation and Concealer. And this is what I'm wearing right now. And I'm kind of liking the, the finish of it. I really do. And this is in the shade 7, Sand. I do may need to find a shade that has a little bit more yellow to it. This one gives me a, a gray. I don't know. I don't know if it does. What do you think, guys? But I like the finish of this. I forgot how much this cost, but I don't think it was that much. I'll put it down below here for you guys. But I am really liking this. I am really liking this foundation. Okay, next I got is by Becca, and this is the Hydra Mist Set and Refresh Powder. This powder right here, I don't know if you've been seeing this around YouTube, but this is made with 50% water and glycerin. And I put this on and it does feel wet on your face. It does feel wet. It does feel like you're putting water on your face. And it, it was kind of freaking me out at first, like, don't, please don't take the makeup off. But when you open it, it does come with like a little bouncy sieve down here. And then you just put your brush and there's, there's what the powder looks like. And then when, you know, when you put it on your face, it does have that wetness feel to it. You know, I'm using my finger, I know. And so far, I really like this. I've just used this a couple times, so we'll see how that goes. But this, this, is, this is just freaky, freaky, that it's a wet feeling. Now, the next thing that I got, actually several items here is from the same brand, and it's by Brigio. This is the Brigio Blossom and Bloom Ginseng Plus Biotin Volumizing Spray. And when I went to Sephora and I tried this and just, I sprayed it on my hair and while I was walking around with Sephora, I was feeling my hair and it felt very soft. I really like that feeling. So I went ahead and got this and this spray costs $20. So it's not a bad price and I do 
love how it feels on my hair. I'm really particular with my hair. I have been losing my hair. It's That's another video in itself because I don't want to get into it because my hair, I'm really sensitive about my hair. I lost over half of my hair. I know it doesn't look like it to you, but I lost a lot of my hair. I got samples of this and I finished it, so I went ahead and got them online. This is the Charcoal and Coconut Oil Micro Exfoliating Shampoo. And when you open it, it looks like a gray type paste, but it's not really thick as a paste. It has peppermint, spearmint, so you can smell that, that minty flavor, and you can kind of feel it working in your scalp. And it has the coconut oil, tea tree oil, vegetable derived micro exfoliating beads. Mm, it does have that minty smell. The camera got hot, I guess, talking about my hair, I start to sweat. <laughs> I know, my hair, yes, it is a sensitive subject for me. Again, like I said, I did lose over 50% of my hair in just two years. It was just a constant shedding. I don't want to get into it that much, but, because again, this video will be too long and too emotional, so why, why do that now? <laughs> so I believe I was here with the Scalp Revival the Charcoal and Coconut Oil Micro Exfoliating Shampoo. And how I use this is I'll just grab like a nickel sized amount and just rub it on my scalp and it has that cooling effect from I guess the peppermint and the spearmint I guess. So it doesn't emulsify, it, it, it doesn't lather. So after I you know scrub and rinse it off, I'll shampoo and put a conditioner. So I'm doing like a double cleanse I guess you can say. And then after I get out of the shower, you know I'll spray the volumizing spray and then I'll put this oil. This is the charcoal and tea tree scalp treatment. And how I use this one is I'll just put a couple of drops in my hand and rub my hands together and just rub my scalp. And just, just you know, I'm not expecting my hair to grow back, but I just want my hair to be healthy and stop the shedding. Hormones, menopause, just, okay. And this is, you know, like an oil, it comes in a dropper. And this is supposed to give you nutrients to the hair, hair follicles to support healthy hair growth. So I'm hoping it does. I mean, I'm not expecting a miracle, but I just want my hair to be healthy again. And I also got this. This is like a little travel size on the go of the volumizing spray and the volumizing shampoo and conditioner. And here they are right here. And I got this just for the sample size or the travel size of the volume spray because I really like this. And here is the shampoo and conditioner. This one, I did use this one today, this morning. It's not my favorite, but I'll, I'll still use it to finish it up. But I really like the travel size of the volume and spray. And I have another palette here. It's not eyeshadow, but this is the Golden Sands Edition by Huda Beauty. This is her bronzer, highlighter, uh, blush combo right here. So I got that. So this is the new one that tends more for the deeper skin tones, so I wanted to try this one. And I saw this at Target, this kit right here, $10. All of this for $10. This is by Profusion. This is the Mix Metals Eyes and Lips, and I bought it in the shade Peach. And it comes with a 9-pan palette. So there's the 9-pan palette right there. It comes with mattes and shimmers. I don't know how this will work, but for $10, I mean, you get, you get a 9-pan palette, a lip pencil, an eyeshadow brush, and I believe this is like liquid lip cream. I mean, again, $10. And the last things I bought, I know, I know, I know. The last things I bought were masks. And this is by Fresh. This is the Lotus Preserve Rescue Mask. I bought a little, the small size in that one. And from Herbivore, I bought the Brightening Mask. I also bought the Blue Tansy Mask, but that one was for a repurchase because I love the Blue Tansy Mask, so I wanted to try the Brightening one. And another one from Herbivore, it's the Pink Clay Mask. This one comes in a powder and you mix it with water to make a paste, so I wanted to try these two. So I haven't tried any of these masks yet. All right, that is my haul. Yeah, I didn't buy them all at one time. I did buy them, you know, separately, and especially when they came on sale. I went ahead and got them when they were on sale. And I also used my points, especially that blush palette and the Visionaire, the Visionary palette. That... You know, hey, I saved $70 with that one using my points. 
She emphasized that to my husband. But anywho, all right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching my haul video. You know, let me know if you've used any of this stuff, if you like any of these things, and if there's other things you want me to try, I'll be willing to try them. <laughs> all right, you guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button so you can see more videos like this. And you all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.